Hello everyone and welcome back to Chemical React. It's a me, Paul, and over there, like always, is my co-host Gorilla Fest. How's it going? Today we have Tokyo Revengers episode 17. All right, that last episode, I'm still thinking about it. Uh, this time I didn't forget. That's that's for Kendi's oh. recordings, right? Oh. <laughs> I don't have to go back and reflect uh. on it. Do you think Takamichi's actually going to bring back Baji? I don't think he's going to bring back the other guy. Hell no. Screw that guy. <laughs> At least for me personally, that's just me. I'm just trying to think of how they can bring him back. Because like, I don't know other than to make that guy who did what he did in last episode uh, what's his name matsuno there we go that's his first name make him apologize but i don't know if mikey will accept that apology i can uh, i don't know too much too much strength from an individual to forgive i guess you could say <laughs> at least for me i, I can't get over I that mean, i, I was... can't get over it man can i feel it in a way i, yeah. I know i understand <laughs> <laughs> but um we still, uh, we we still don't know if like maybe Baja is being like a double agent, something sneaky. So before we start, if you do enjoy our content, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also, join our Patreon if you want to support us and get access to our Patreon versions of this episode and many more. And without further ado, fusion, I got my fingers up. And three, two, one, go. Yeah. You think Mikey wants to bring uh, Baji back to keep him away from the other guy? Uh, that's a good possibility. That's what I think it really Might is. I think he wants to keep him away from that guy. Really? I kind of get it, taking the ball and like being the backup, but at the same time, this wasn't your fault to begin with. But he was an accomplice. <laughs> Traitor! He's gone to the dark side! On Halloween? Remember I was talking about Halloween off camera? Yeah. It's a sign. looks familiar oh the guy that got beat oh, up yeah yeah the vice the vice captain oh okay thought he looked familiar that i figure is much what's the real motive tell us tell us the plan hit me with it oh Oh, it all comes back to Kisaki. What? So Kisaki was the spy? Kisaki's the ringleader behind Valhalla. That's what it is. I can understand that. <laughs> I feel the same way. I just want revenge fusion. <laughs> <laughs> I want revenge. It was, it was supposed to be Mikey's birthday present. Ah oh, man, the feels. That's right. Revenge. <laughs> oh, I've never seen him so serious. Different kind of serious. Did he ever explain himself why you punch Kisaki? This was angry. Yeah, but you have to justify no your anger. You can't just be like, oh, this guy, uh, I'm angry. Because, you just because he thought guy. about him killing everyone. I know. He's but the like, reason behind all the death. I That's know, the but, reason. Yes, but when you go back in past, you still have to keep up the act that you don't know the future. At least Takamichi does. It's just you can't really explain. Hey, and yeah. he cries all the time and deals with tons of shit. So he let his anger out and punched the fuck out of him. You can explain it here? 
There we go. Oh shit. There we go. Well, look at that declaration. Yeah, I like that. Damn straight. Doesn't he have Mikey's jacket? I feel inspired. I'm no longer angry anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I'm glad. He doesn't know why he does things. <laughs> he does no. things. Like Deku, he's a hero. He has gotta go. Oh, look. Just do. And thus friendship was formed. Ah, oh, shit. And then bam, goes back to the past. In future? <laughs> Interesting. A wood shop? Is this where all the X members oh. work at? Oh. Oh! Is this the foundation of the construction site from the future? Uh, I, I'm not sure. Who the hell's that guy? Looks like a shady businessman. He does, right? <laughs> How much you want to bet he's not that shady, but he's just really scrawny. I think he's what? Why both? We can't shine in his own. Man, you're talking like like you Dracula or something. <laughs> That's Kisaki. What? <laughs> Damn. Well, that makes a lot more sense now. Hmm, interesting. Wow. See, Kisaki's the ringleader behind everything. You kind of figure as much, right? He's like a fucking genius. But it's like, I can't tell if he's, if Kisaki's really that, uh, what's it called? He can think that far ahead and plan to organize everything. If he does have that ability, he's really dangerous. But that tells me that Kisaki has a fucking sharp brain, dude. Look, see, he planned everything. Yep, there you go. There you go. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Mm. Hmm. My goodness. Which we avoided. Yeah. Which kind of didn't uh, happen. No, it didn't happen. Okay. Hmm. It's all connected, Gorilla. All this tells me we got to outplay and outsmart Kisaki. And right now, you have, with these two guys? We do have time manipulation abilities. Yeah, but they still have to prove and verify and have the evidence say Kisaki's behind all of this. And given how Kisaki can actually think ahead, even if you get rid of him now, he'll still come back, right? He'll definitely try to get hurt. Uh, oh, he's scared of Kisaki. Ah, <laughs> this is the episode where everything comes together for me, Fusion. Look, theory confirmed. What? Oh, he's not. Mikey! Damn! What a twist. Or Mikey. By who? What? The bloody Halloween. Bloody Halloween. 
No relation to uh, Valentine Massacre. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's a big bombshell right there. Oh my goodness. And it ends right there, too. Yeah. What a cliffhanger. That was, uh, I thought, well, I thought one theory was one thing, but it turns out something else entirely. Yeah. Uh, so I was not expecting this. I was expecting this to be like another episode where they kind of go back and we're going to be left in the in the dust of what the hell's going on. And he was like, no, we're going to give you everything. Everything. And now, have fun with that. <laughs> Watch so it unfold. Was, <laughs> Bala was made for Mikey. Yes. By who? That's to be determined. Uh, and Mikey kills Kazu. Mm -hmm. And it looks like Baja was on the ground. Yep, Bond, he also had the code on, so it seemed like he was fighting for Valhalla, but from what we understand, given from his vice commander or his vice captain, that it was supposedly all... he's the you know the He's the a spy. spy out the spy. Yeah, he's a spy. Yeah. And I don't know, I like he's the fact he... that he was getting beat up. He's like, oh yeah, he's awesome. How is he telling Takemichi like yeah, he's awesome? <laughs> he said he got beat up by Bad, but oh man, that guy, he's a homie. He's crazy though. But we got a new new uh, helper, new new best friend for Takamichi to hang out with. A, a new right, a, a new, right hand man. A new right hand or comrade for Mike uh, Takamichi. He his also, first follower. Oh, let's not forget uh that we saw the old commander Mobius. He's terrified of Kisaki. He's basically Kisaki is behind everything. Planned so, it all out way ahead of time. You got you got gang warfare, then you got manipulation, then you got some spy, a little bit of espionage, if that makes sense for some people, and then you got some betrayal, then you got some time traveling, then you got a slice of life, and then you got to like, you got that girlfriend that kind of dies but comes back just for a brief couple of minutes to only die again, you know what I mean? Just to give us a little bit of romance and like hope for our main <laughs> protagonist, and it's just like, then it all washes away. Okay, anyway, this show, there's a lot of things to go on this show that we can talk about. It clearly is what I'm saying. A lot of different threads to follow. They all end up going to the same knot that then you have to untangle to go to other knots. Yeah. So, with that being said, in the comic section, let me know what was the most surprising moment. I mean, oh my god, there's so many. I think I, everything surprised me at the end. Uh, anything else you want to add to Fusion? Any predictions was going to happen next episode? Next episode, right? Oh, well, if, if, well, it depends whether or not Bloody Halloween's happening next episode. This is true. If Bloody Halloween happens next episode. I think Takamichi's gonna, he's gonna avert avert something. Probably Mikey's killing, mm -hmm. but I don't know if he'll exactly change everything. He seems to freak out during big situations. Yeah. If it's not the next episode for the fight, uh, maybe try to talk more sense in the Baja to change things. I don't know. Yeah, I can only hope for one thing, and that's Takamichi becoming the leader, because I'm so glad he said it. I'm so happy that we <laughs> can get now we can start building the freaking foundations for him to become a boss. So with that being said, I think that wraps it up. And like always, guys, we'll see you in the next episode.